Good evening, Joe. Citizens complaints about pests to the 311 hotline plus online reports went from 22,300 in fiscal year 2012 to 24,586 the next year. City Comptroller Scott Steger said Sunday. Rats are daily stomach turning insult to New Yorkers, whether they're scurrying over people's feet on sidewalks, invading homes where children sleep or swimming through restaurants, Steger said. Steger said an audit conducted by his office found that the City Department of Health and Mental Hygiene isn't managing its pest control program effectively. They audit said the audit said the said health inspectors didn't always follow on their own protocols and in 160 cases no file inspection was conducted. A health department spokesman told New York's Daily News that the agency strongly disagrees with the audit and is taking a protective response to examining pests in the city. Phone and email messages from the Associated Press requesting comment were not immediately returned on Sunday. Auditors found that in 24% of the case exams, the agency did not check out complaints within its own 10-day target, Steger said. In addition, action was stopped permanently on some citizen complaints before the required number of expectation attempts, according to the audit. And in fiscal year 2013, there was no induction that assumed were conducted in 44% of 386 instants where inspectors requested cleanup services. The controller also reported that the department failed to notify some property owners about city orders to eliminate rodent conditions, increase, increasing the risk that rat in infections could spread through a neighborhood. The Comptroller's comp Office recommend that the Health Department identify complaints that have been pending a long time, ensure complaints are not closed after only one failed attempt to gain access to a site and make sure problems in the field have been dealt with effectively and completely. Reporting live here in the studio, I'm Ray Lee King for WABC Eyewitness News. Joe, back over to you.